Hey guys, what's going on? It's Daily Gaming here, and I am back with some more Men of War Assault Squad 2. Actually playing on a different computer this time, so not entirely sure how that's going to affect things. It's actually a better computer, so it'll probably do probably a lot better, um, in all honesty, you know, performance-wise, and I've got the, the graphics increased and whatnot, but either way, uh, gonna be playing against a subscriber. This guy's named MegaMan170. And uh, we're gonna see how we can uh, we can fare against him. There's no skybox in this map for some reason, but that's all right. Uh, actually, we should not be stopping here. What am I doing? Already off to a, a rough start here, stopping at uh, at my own point instead of going further, which is pretty stupid. And we gotta leave some people here to defend it. All right, man, I am just so tired. Spent all day yesterday doing shit and. Uh, now I'm just I'm just out of it, just exhausted. But you know what? Had a good time. All right, so we're setting our guys up here. Hopefully this computer's fan isn't like too obnoxious. It's kind of loud, and I wonder if you can hear it through the mic. If you can, next video I'm probably gonna have to figure out a way to adjust it so. We don't get obnoxious fan noises, you know? Because that is no fun at all. Alright, we're trying to sneak this guy up here. Semi forgot it's Rob's mod, so it's quite difficult to do that, and he's dead. Alright, that's okay. Uh, we still got these guys back here. It's not a bad situation right now, in all honesty, you know? We've got our people still alive, <clears throat> and uh, we just haven't taken that point, which is okay, you know. We're going to bring up another Volks Grenadier squad here and bring it up to the left. By the way, this is the African Expedition map? Yeah, African Expedition. Um, man, really bad intro to this video. I don't know. I'm just I'm kind of kind of out of it, but we'll, uh, we'll get back into it, I guess. And we're going to sneak this guy forward because he does have an MP40, meaning he can't fire from that far away, but didn't matter anyway because he died. Uh, so we do have these guys going forward this way, and he does appear to already have a shit ton of men over here. We need our guys to get over into this crevice real quick, lag. They are falling. They are falling big time. Oh yeah. A bad situation. Alright. Does he have a mortar? It's one of those, uh, captains with the, uh, the rocket launcher. <clears throat> I'm afraid we might have to end up just sort of chilling until, until we manage to get some vehicles here. Because at the moment, we're not going to be making any leeway on these positions. Which is kind of a shame. Because we're going to lose some points to it, but, I mean... Heck, we're not going to suicide forward, you know? Uh, we'll use a mortar here, though. Soften them up on this end. Man, these textures are so, so freaking nice. That I've got, uh... I've got the settings on, like, Ultra, I think, so... Obviously a lot better quality, which is very nice for us. Yeah, I'm playing like shit right now. We're going to bring up a Volkstrom squad. Sort of spread them out across the map, I'd say. Probably the best bet. Uh, yeah, we'll get a lot of guys over here. Uh, I'm worried for an assault right now. <clears throat> I think that's what's coming up. Uh, whoops, that's the wrong button. G gets them out of there. There we go. We'll get a guy up here. Watch for a flank. Oh god, wait. You have to go up that way? Oh, there's no way up these mountains anyway. Alright, we're fine. It's okay. Also, he acted as a sort of uh, scout for the people up here. And yeah, he's got a great wall of China going there, so we're going to be able to pick him off pretty easy. Can we get up there? Oh, we have to go this way. Let's try and spring some guys in here. Probably not going to work out for us, but heck, that's okay. Oh, let me get the hell out of there. Get that mortar out of there. Go! God damn it. Really, he was able to bum rush us with one guy, 
Meanwhile, my guys can't, like, fucking move an inch without dying. Ugh. That's alright. That's alright. We'll get some tank crew up here. I hope this shows you guys how bad I am at this game when it's not the editor. I'm I'm not the worst player ever. I understand the mechanics and stuff like that, but I'm not that good, you know? Don't expect that dynamite gameplay. These are just Volkstrom as well, so I mean, I'm not expecting big things from them. We've got another SMG over here uh, to keep that from happening again. We do have our our sneaky beaky little Volkstrom over here, who are doing a little bit against them, which is nice. We can get a 223 pretty soon, or we can get it right now actually, but let's let's get an actual Panzer, as well as a Volksgrenadier squad. <clears throat> and we're just gonna we're gonna just absolutely annihilate this uh, this zone over here with people, because he spent a lot of money early on on uh, on the infantry that he has. So I'm thinking if we can if we can use our vehicle power to our advantage, that'll be good. Although we've spent a lot on the infantry as well. We just killed the Bren gun, which is gonna be very helpful. Go ahead and attack ground right there. He's kind of already doing that. I don't know where his his men are. We're gonna have to find out the hard way. Get these guys ready to go in. There they all are. Oh god, turret damage! Ow! Fuck! Penetration. We're gonna go down, so we might as well. Uh, down swinging, but that didn't work out. Yeah, that thing's getting obliterated now. Ah, uh, he's got a pounder over there. I'm so bad at Rob's <laughs> one. I'm a lot better at vanilla, in all honesty. It doesn't really matter when you're playing Rob's, so. though. We are playing Rob's. Look at all those guys. Shit. Alright. Well. Hmm. What we might do here is... Oh, he's charging them. He's charging them forward. I'm kinda confident in our defenses here. Yeah, they're killing him. They're killing him. Keep getting him. Keep getting him, guys. Oh god, he's reloading. Oh, the mortar saves the day. Okay. Um... We need something a little stronger. I don't know. <clears throat> we might try another assault over here. I guess. Which could work out um, if we back it up with a Panzer F. So we'll give that a go. Let's do that. Still assaulting over here. It seems like he's just wasting men on this mortar. I'm not even gonna continue this assault. Oh, he's going after these three guys over here now. Not the best plan, dude. Oh shit! I didn't even throw that. That was the AI. That's all right. They'll be okay over there. This guy's all out of ammo. No, you're not. Wait. I don't know why he wasn't. Shooting. Weird. Weird things. Alright, my guys over here are engaged now. Try and spread them out. Alright. So we have multiple engagements going on now. Buying cheap units to try and push. Plus a cheeky little tank here. Gotta watch out because I don't know where that 25 pounder is. You know? I think it's still back at his spawn where he had it. Okay, we're gonna charge this squad forward. 
if the tanks and it should be okay. Well, I think he used his own mortar against our stuff over there. Uh, that's fine. <clears throat> we'll just buy a Lafayette and put it over there in case of any attacks. Some shit like that. Try and kill that guy. Good. Now it's time to sprint forward here. You guys, why don't you spread out onto these rocks? I think I saw a guy somewhere over here, right? Or maybe he's dead. That'd be good if he was dead. Alright. We have successfully captured this area. And <clears throat> now we gotta go about defending it. I'm gonna bring a Flak 38 up here. That's not something I do very often, buying flak guns and stuff, but uh, with such a wide open map, he's gonna have to infantry rush if he wants to do anything. So, a flak gun would protect very well against that. It's also got, you know, some some armor penetration ability, so that is of course going to be utilized as well. Alright. No sandbag kits, which is kind of a problem. There's a Sherman 5 coming. That is a larger gun, which is going to be a problem. We're going to bring a Goliath up here, see if we can get a cheeky Goliath shot on it. Um, <clears throat> actually, we're going to hug this mountain here with our guy. Let's use heat shots. We're going to try and get into this crevice here. And then if he pushes forward with that, uh, we can just nicely cut him off. What is that? Fuck a Churchill. We can't handle a Churchill. That church ain't got no chill, man. Alright. Churchills are, are heavy duty. Heavy, heavy duty. We're gonna need a uh, bazooka infantry over here. Nope. Let's do that. Alright, you are screwed, dude. There's our Goliath. Where's our other shit? We got three guys back here still. I'll let you guys come forward, because there's about to be a hell of a battle up here. Oh, this way. oh our Panzer is actually getting some shots on him. Which is awfully nice. It's not really doing anything though, and it's turning. Oh, it's turning. Churchill doesn't have a good gun, but it's capable of killing us. It's okay. Where the heck is this? Oh, that. There it is. <laughs> Alright, try and get that forward, please. I would get a, um, a pack gun or something up here, but it's a little too late for that. We're, we're past that point. We're going to try and scoot this around the outskirts here. <coughs> this Goliath. Try and use that if we can. This thing's getting closer. That's a gun breach. That's no good. Fuck. Oh shit. Alright, listen, Goliath, you are the you are the champ here. I don't know, do we go for the Fury or do we go for the Churchill? If we can get the double, that'd be glorious, but I say we go for the Fury right now. That's not even a Fury, that's just a Sherman. I don't know why I keep saying Fury. Look at all these infantry here, too. Oh, we could get the double. Oh, God. Did we get the... Oh, my God, the Sherman didn't die at all. What the fuck? All right, we are getting heavy-duty charged right now. Black gun should be opening up now. Hopefully. Uh, we need a Nebelwerfer as well. That's a good buy right there. Um, oh, let's get a G up here. Not gonna really be able to penetrate much, but might be able to do something. Alright, you, my friend, try and get up Oh no, you don't have any AP grenades, or AT grenades, actually. Or rather. Let's try and get this guy in this mortar hole. Cap. That'd be good. Try and get these guys forward too. We'll get them over here. Hopefully. Alright, this thing's back alive. It's just not really firing. 
hopefully gets to firing pretty soon. Uh, here's a Panzer G that we're bringing up. Fuck. This is tough right here. Right, you guys don't have grenades, of course. Nope, you don't, because you're Volkstrom and you're crap. Kind of the way it goes, I guess. Oh, maybe that did take out the Sherman. That would actually be awesome if it did. I didn't realize it did. Until later. Well, until right now, I guess. Oh, yes! The Churchill's down! Alright, repair that shit. Get some infantry up here. It's now... It's now okay to get some infantry up here. Good stuff. That needs to be repaired. Please do so. Should we just pepper the the entire area with uh, with a little Nebelwerfe fire or what? Oh no, there's no one even in here. We'll just run this guy in then. Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Get down! All right, now search these guys. Try and no, don't reload right now. You dick! Give me that. Also, I just noticed we're getting assaulted over here by some shit. Good thing we brought that Lafayette up here. Or Lafette, sorry. I always say Lafayette with this thing. Yeah, it's crushing them. That's good. That's good right there. Alright. You guys, <clears throat> go ahead over there. A couple of you. Why don't you come this way? Closer. You, my friend, can go over there. And we're looking a little bit more secure over here now. Uh, Lafette went down. Alright, did its job pretty well. We'll just hop some more people on there, I guess. Oh, we brought up another Sherman 5, only to get it pinned right away by my, uh... By my nice little Panzer G over here. Which is beautiful. Uh, this thing kind of poses a threat only for the Lafette, but it just got taken out by the Lafette, so... Don't see a problem really anymore. How much ammo does this bad boy have? I can't even read that. 250. Not really worth spending my money on a crate right now for my flank. <clears throat> Just for it to, like, you know, get taken over again, potentially. So, <clears throat> I'm going to leave those guys with their 250 ammo and hope they can, uh, they can do something about it. Still got this flat gun over here. And it just almost shot one of our dudes. Not exactly the nicest thing to do. I'm gonna move these guys further forward. But just give me one of them, and we're gonna hop him on the flag 38. And we're gonna scooch that a little bit more forward. I think right about there, I think, is good. Yeah. He's saving for something. That's what he's doing right now. This might actually be manable. But I don't actually want to send. Oh, yeah, fuck. No, no, never mind. I don't want to send these guys that way. I don't think. I think we'll buy uh, buy a tank crew for it, and we'll send them over here. I'm all out of CP, so whatever he sends to me, I'm gonna have to use what I got to to defend. Which I mean, he's obviously saving for something, so it could be a little while, could be no time at all. A little too early to tell. That's okay. All right. Yeah, come on. Out. Just want to make sure we're all right over here. <clears throat> uh, if he def attacks over here, he's definitely going to be a lot better off. Although we can twist this Nebulva for towards either direction. Can it hit out here? Yeah, easily. And then you just rotate it this way, and it can really quickly hit out there. So, Nebelwürfe is definitely going to be something we're going to use. I think this thing is, like, almost fully functional. It says it is. Go ahead and repair it and see what's up. Oh, God. One of those, really? It's alright. We got this guy with our... Uh, fucking, uh, 
Panzerfaust. Oh god. No, 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 no. Panzerfaust is down. Panzerfaust down! Panzerfaust down! Yeah, you're not gonna be able to pin that. Fuck, he died. It's actually not dead, it's screwable. Alright, we're gonna set our Panzerfaust from back here over here. And, uh. Maybe we can get a flank on him. Oh god, he's got guys right there. Shite. Oh, shot through the window! Damn! Alright. No more Panzerfausts? Yeah. Shit. Save AT grenades? No! God! Oh, we don't have anyone really. Let's get by Goliath at least. Alright, so this thing's back alive. We still have two tanks, which is nice. That will certainly be helpful. And we've got the flat gun. What we are gonna do is we're gonna run this guy over here, across the crossfire. Gonna search this bad boy. And we're gonna go ahead and uh, pick up that nice little TNT there. We're gonna just duck it down. This thing's still alive, yeah. This thing lost its crew. I think it was uh, something to do with the shell or whatever. It only needs one crew member, I guess. Uh, uh. So that thing's just sitting there. So maybe we can get a cheeky Goliath on it. Yeah, that thing's gone. So what's that? Guess what? That opened us up to get a tiger. Or a panther if we want later on. Um, he's sending that shit up right now though, so I'm saying we buy a tiger right now and we deal with this problem. This little tank here is actually stuck by the freaking turret of the dead panzer. Always helpful. Alright. Our STG 44 is mowing down some of those guys, but. Uh, looks like we did end up losing a couple, but we came out on top with that battle. We still got plenty of infantry over here. That thing is going to kill us. I'm so worried about this. Oh god. This may or may not work. Don't stop to shoot this thing. Don't you do it. Don't you do it. <gasps> Glorious. No. Oh god. <laughs> We didn't get it. There's also a Sherman back there. Fuck. Okay. Well, we've got our we got our tiger coming forward. That's something, right? White. Um. Oh god. Um. We need more. We need to use the Nebel. Gotta use it. Right there. Come on, give me some good shots. That was pretty good. Yeah, alright. That worked out. That worked out. Sometimes nebbles are shit. Sometimes they're pretty cheeky. God, track left is hit. God, I missed. Kind of pathetic. Give him, like, the full front armor. Good. Okay, come on. Sure. We, gotta, we gotta get close if we wanna pin this thing. That's that sure as hell gonna be a challenge. You need to get out a grenade right now. Toss it, fuck! Okay. Um, I say we get a... 222 over here to take care of the infantry while our tiger duels it out with the this fucking shit. We're gonna take out the Sherman because I know we can take that out. He's rushing his infantry towards me. Fuck, go the fuck away. Go the hell away. Go the heck away. Go away. Go away. Go away. Go away. 
now our side is completely exposed. Come on, Tuchi Tu, where the hell are you? We need you. We need you right now. Oh, come on. Go. Oh. My God. Oh. Jesus Christ. I was just fixing my mic right there. It looked it's all tangled and I was worried it was fucking with the audio. Sherman 5 is down. <laughs> Big time down. I mean, we could try and flank with this thing. <clears throat> Not sure if it's gonna work. Definitely isn't. Yeah, especially when that happens. But heck, let's get right up against it. Go ahead and do that, self-destruct. And uh, that might blow it up. Uh, he's sending forward a Crusader. That's not gonna do anything against my Tiger. So that's not a worry. This thing still is, though. Which we're getting some good shots on it. Oh boy. There's nothing we can do but wait for this thing to reload. Here comes another infantry matchup. Uh oh. Track hit. We need to kill this little bad boy back here first. Come on, I'm not worried about infantry right now. Oh! Fuck. I shot the Sherman way back there. To do that, it just kind of happened. Right, we got the cover advantage with those guys. We need to kill this thing. Oh, please stop shooting at me. Alright, that thing's dead. Um, Goliath time. It's worked twice for us, almost. The second time, but like the first time, most definitely it worked. They're trying to get around here with some guys. Fuck. Fuck! No. No! No! Shit. No! Engine damage. Fuck me. Oh, God. Crew is bailing. Alright, let's get a Panzer H. Get that up here. That ought to do some shit. Oh! Whoa, 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 whoa. Alright, they're dead. Um. Actually, actually, no. Scratch it. We're attacking his other place. Over here. And we're gonna attack with the Goliath first as recon. <clears throat> then we're sending in uh, tank and infantry can manage to probably take it out. We'll artillery over here, though. And, uh, that'll sort of be like a little feign. And, uh, he'll maybe think we're attacking over this way. Yeah, we got a couple kills. Probably not many are gonna go down, though, since we're just shooting blind. Let's move this as well. Um, we don't want it to get caught anything like that. Alright, time to send in the Goliath. It's Goliath time, baby. Alright. I know there's guys to the right. Alright. You guys over here, too. Many, though. Not many at all. Panzer IV doing a great job of covering. Gotta be careful of that croc, because that's still a factor here. Watch out for those flankers, too. The croc's just chilling over there. 
this here. What is that? It's a machine gun or something? Uh oh. Here comes a swamp of men. What the fuck, dude? God, kill them. Kill them all, please. Jesus Christ. That's way too many goddamn men. Crew injured on our, uh, on our tank, though. We're not even messing with the crew. Let's just rotate this way. <coughs> and get some infantry to cover that tank, because it's very vulnerable right now. And get some infantry going forward this way, too. And we're just mowing them down, absolutely. Beautiful. Alright, we need our infantry up here, like, right now. Oh god, another croc. <coughs> How can he afford all these? What the fuck? Also, shall we hop in this thing? And rotate her around. And try and kill him that way. Do it. Get her. Tater. Oh, run from the grenade. Kill him. Good shit, boyos. Oh, we got a Churchill. We have got ourselves a Churchill. Churchill down. Alright, we're gonna send infantry over here. Ah, uh, this guy doesn't have a grenade. Would've been helpful right now. It's okay, though. Alright, we got a nice, nice shot on those guys. And he's spamming more men forward. Someone get in that. Get in that right now. And you guys get the hell on the ground. Right, work your magic. Kill those dudes. Oh my god. It's a slaughter. The spam is so real. He's spending, sending more men forward. Such not a good tactic, dude. Oh, he's sending another squad forward. Meanwhile, like, we're just mowing him down with his own MG. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Absolutely decimating them. Alright, wow. Wow, wow, wow. Meanwhile, our tank is fine over here. Uh, we're gonna put a guy over here. We just need to make sure this thing is defended. Did that Churchill over here die? It might have, actually. That'd be really nice. Oh, that thing's still alive, though. That Churchill over here is alive as heck, man. Which is no bueno. That might not even be a Churchill, is it? No, that is a Churchill. Alright, it's time to kill this thing. Do you have APCR? We do. We might actually be able to do an APCR rush on it. I think our turret's damaged, actually. Or no, we don't have enough gunners to have a working turret. We've got some of their tank crew. This is a derpy-ass battle right here. We're gonna lose it, I guarantee. But... Oh my god! Do we... Oh, he just went out for repairs. There we go, we got it. Why would you go out in the midst of battle for repairs? Look! Hit hold top! Quit weakening our tank, dude. Get the hell out of there. That's the problem with this map, is the points are so close to spawns. Like, if he pushed my point, he'd be right in my spawn like I am right now on his. 
Yeah, I just took out that Sherman too. <coughs> We're backing the hell up. Gotta back the heck up, man. Back the heckity heck up. Alright. Back. Should we try and push over here, do you think? And try and just solidify these points? Then we'd be in a very dominant lead. I'm thinking a 2 2 2 over here would help. And we just use that to, uh, to push out any infantry. Okay. Uh, these infantry guys over here aren't really in any sort of a helpful position, so we're going to move them. Um, what are you shooting at? I don't think anything right now. Man, the fan is really loud on this computer, which is kind of a shame, but I'm hoping it's not really that audible. If it is, I think I'll still upload it because this is a really great match, and hopefully you guys can still actually hear me. But at the same time, um, <clears throat> I'm definitely going to work on fixing it if it is way too loud in post, so, you know. Really? You're bringing up that? That is not going to pin a panzer for my friend. Actually, shell shatter it. But, I mean, I just did that. <laughs> so, there's that. See, the nice thing about this computer is it's so good, you know? It's really great. But, uh, the, the fan is just very loud. Very, very loud. So, I'm hoping you guys can't hear it too well. But you might be able to. Alright, this is why we brought the 222 up here. Let's take care of those dudes. You're coming forward. And we are killing them. Alright, well... I would say this game is probably in the bag right about now. We've got him pretty crippled. He wasted most of his money on these many, many squads. I mean, look. The red are his men. The yellow are my men. I've lost a fair amount, but look how many in comparison. Wait, we can just press tab. I've lost 129, but killed 237 of his men. We've killed the same amount of our tanks, though, which is actually kind of fascinating. Uh, he's direct controlling that flamethrower. Too bad it just died. Oh boy. Alright, well. I can't imagine he has much more money. He bought a Tetrarch, though. I mean, if he keeps it below that ridge, which he didn't, uh, if he had kept it below this ridge, he could have avoided my, uh, my Panzer and gun up here and taking these guys out, but that's okay. Um, this guy's kind of new. He had like, I don't know, like 30 or 40 games played, I think, which is a fair amount. Like, he, he definitely knows the controls now and knows the things. Um, and he did very well in the beginning stages here, but I think I just sort of, I was able to, to poke at his weak points enough to actually destroy him. And then I think spamming these infantry, uh, infantry squads was his sort of fatal flaw in this battle. Which is understandable, you know, like, it's definitely... It's a tactic I've seen done well, and I think a lot of YouTubers use it, but they, they do it in such a way that it's, like, advantageous to them, so it can be sort of misleading when you see a YouTuber do that. But I always think three well-placed men is better than ten poorly placed men. And we won! Woo! Alright, good game, man. Thanks for playing. I really appreciate you playing with me, dude. Um, if you guys do want to get into some games with me, message me and I'll, I'll set her up. Uh, yeah, let's do GG. GG! Alright, guys, thanks so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Uh, comment, rate, and subscribe if you did. And I'll talk to y'all later. Peace! Uh,